Welcome to our uncut footage of the NARBC Tinley Park March of 2024 show. How this will differ from our walkthrough is this going to be a more detailed view with more focus on individual animals. It's not going to be a consistent walk from the beginning to the end. It's going to be a much closer up look of a lot of the footage that we get. With that said, hope you enjoy. Let's get right into it. Do you want me to get a lot of footage of it? Yeah. Have any, uh, okay. Are you out of those? I've or you don't have you know, yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah, I was pretty sure you said that in October, but I just wanted to verify. Yeah. Just in case, but yeah, the only even Europe now is nice. We'll catch up with you later. Okay, we'll be back. We'll be back. The only one I'm currently working with is Yeah. yeah. <laughs> How was their care and everything compared to the Fibriatus? How was their care compared to the Fibriatus? Uh, it's warmer. They actually, those are beach and I like the stuff that you replace. Okay. Like high 70s, low 80s. Okay. Yeah. Oh, wow, yeah. For your place, yeah. Yeah, that is, yeah. That's super warm. Because usually it's like, you know, the low 70s. Yeah. Along with it being humid as all. Yeah, there's a lot of orange jeans for sure. The Australian Barking Gecko. Or is that just... I think it's a solo cow. Yeah. I don't know where Joe's... I don't know where Joe's came from, but... <laughs> Joe, how much are your Hawaiian lines? Uh, they are... Yeah, I know. She's like, sign me up. You know, and it's a last thing I do. I'm buying all the last things I absolutely do. I'm buying another water dragon. I've got like, oh my goodness. And I have more geckos, but I don't have those more geckos. I like these ones better. They're so. You work with uh, Green Sickle Shed or no? Nah, no, we were talking about it a little bit, nice but uh, like pastel, pastel, so yeah, I I, uh, I think dream sickles are gorgeous, but it's just not a recessive I ever got into, the lavender stuff. And then, like, I'm working with Monarch quite a bit, so that's kind of my only, like, albino type. And obviously, that's a T-positive, but that's only of the albino type genes that I'm working. Yeah, I like Monarch stuff. Monarch stuff's nice. I mean, a dream sickle like that is like undeniably beautiful. Oh, yeah. Like any person would think that that's sure. a beautiful you don't even know best thing. Exactly. Yeah. Like that's the perfect thing. But yeah. like, you know, it's just not something that I'm in. But I think I have about nine or ten recessive genes already. It's like I can't um, without no, having that huge on collection. Yep. You gotta focus on certain things. You don't want to go all over the place. Yeah. Well, originally they thought they were gonna be able to just wear it. Yeah, I'm definitely interested in like the camera's doing a favor actually. Puzzle stuff currently. It's incredible. Yeah. Well, uh, I think it's yeah. It's cryptic, yeah. cryptic in the pairing, widow in the pairing, and puzzle in the pairing. So That's complicated, yeah. Uh, 
Sending that to Kyle? Yeah. starting to already express the white sides. That's so cool. So, yeah, more, a lot like Dad. Um, so these are from 23, mm -hmm. and then these are 22s. And the Annery is from the same clutch. Wow, this one's really having, so this tells me this will have a high expression. That's really, really neat. Right yeah. I don't think these get the attention they deserve. No, I know. <laughs> That's why we bring Dad because they look so much. Yeah. Diff so different. That's crazy cool. Can't imagine if you got those colors in like like something else like a little python would be like millions of dollars. Not literally, but you know. So but tens of thousands. <laughs> yes, very much so. So yeah, these do not get the attention they deserve. The more you look at it, you're gonna probably end up keeping it. Well, yeah, I'm actually <laughs> thinking about this one because usually the anneries don't sh don't ha show the white, mm -hmm. and this one is starting to show. That's so cool. it'll either be all black or all gray with the white sides. 
Oh, that's not. That is very, very cool. Well, thank you again. Hey, let's drop towns. I think the issue, I think maybe there's a little different. It might be a little harder to assist the hot hog noises. The like smaller and girls typically. Some of them they'll eat whatever. Sable and Exanza. Oh, dang. Uh, it's okay. a girl. And then uh, I also have a extreme red um, tiger albino girl. Um, she just looked gorgeous. Uh, so I, I eat snack her as well. So I kind of want to go down that. I think. Huh. He's very used to being handled. This is probably like his fourth show. His name's Charmeleon. <laughs> it's a perfect name. Yeah. So they're starting to like. Yeah, I don't know what it was. Hidden ones, much made. They were just very calm, very mellow. Yeah. The one girl I got, the uh, one that's hit for, or possible hit for all that stuff, um, she's really very relaxed. The other one, she is a perfect example of all talk to. Yeah. When I first got her out, she was going already, yeah. doing the, the fake yeah. stuff, and then <clears throat> she would go at my own hand with like these crazy upside down bluff strikes. That's hilarious, upside down. <laughs> yeah, she like, there's a video of us unboxing her, and she like 
oh, flipped. Hilarious. She flipped and just, and it's all just smashing her head into me. It's hilarious. That's so funny. And they're the they're the best eaters. Yeah. They're they just everything just just they're so good. Yeah. So. Yeah, exactly. Like they really don't deserve that reputation. I don't think so. Yeah. That's not been my experience at all. And yeah. I got them young, mm -hmm. and I wanted to challenge myself yeah. um, to try to have one, just right. prove to myself that I can beat that. Yeah. You know, because when you start breeding them yourself, it's a little different. Right. You know, when you get the babies. Oh yeah. So when I, you breed them, you're definitely gonna run into that with a couple of them. How do you, you matter, beat that? What's that? Like, how do you beat that? Like scenting usually. Um, if they're real stubborn, like there's a few things we do. First, we'll try braining. Uh, mm -hmm. so you I just, know what that is, yep. Uh, and then we'll just try like a little bit of uh, tuna. Tuna scenting seems to do the trick on a lot of them. Um, and welcome to you guys. If you guys want to hold anybody, just come on up. Let me know if you see anyone you want to hold. All of them. All of them? All right, there you go. I collect hog noses. Oh, So we're talking about getting his, his, his first male. He's got two females already. The bug, the bug grows pretty quickly, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> It does. I've got I'm very happy smells. to see hog noses are starting to crazy ground. You guys got a nice spot this year too. Oh yeah. Actually, he's got another show. Yeah. 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 This is really my first lap of doing so yes. yeah. Look at this one right here. Oh, that's cool. Mm -hmm. What is that? That it almost looks like a patternless, but it's like oh, it's a monsoon. Oh shoot! Holy cow! <laughs> Speaking of monsoon, I have a snake to pick up. Um, so I want it on the option. Uh, thank you. Thank you. 
Yeah. You think you're home in the backyard? Yeah. Guess what? You want to come by today? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Let yeah. me fill it up. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right? So yeah, ever since then he hasn't really talked to us. We do have um, a big suit this winter in Canada.
Thank you. This is just, it's super blackhead, it's cinnamon. I can't be positive, but I think it's super blackhead, super cinnamon. But you can also, I found out, you can make it, it doesn't have to be super cinnamon, it can be cinnamon and black pastel. Yeah, yeah. Barnard line black pastel. Let me bring that here. You guys can see, like, he's iridescent. Jesus. Yeah. And he's yeah. black. You can you see look at him next to your colors, thing, so. how black he is. Not quite as black as that, yeah, but yeah. close. But the iridescence, I didn't expect that when you first got him out. The, the light, uh, yeah. or not the light, but the, the cover almost like hides that. Yep. And I love the, the way the white creeps up from the belly. And then you get these ringers. You know, you don't always get a ringer, but you always have white creeping up. Huh? I think it's high, too. like looking at it from like a yeah. car with all look the white the coming up and yeah. yeah. Uh, the so white creeps just, up on the face. There we go. Yeah. Super cool. That is awesome. Yeah, this was... I thought it was awesome, but when you pull, that's even better. Yeah, when you get it out in the sun, you... I mean, it's a rainbow. It's iridescent all over. That's better than the painted light. <laughs> yeah, I think they're really cool, and you know, I've only... As far as I know, there's only a couple of them. I didn't make this. I bought it. Um, well, it was a good buy. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Um, and um, But I was able to reproduce. I made 1.1 myself this year. The guy that I got them from was thinking it had champagne in it. I didn't see any champagne in it. And I'm thinking it's just super black. Did you get it tested or not? No. But I don't know that they have a test. I don't know which ones they have to test for. They have a... In other words, like, let's just say he tests it because it... He can test super blackhead and super um, cinnamon. He, I don't know what else could be in it. It could be something else, but I don't see it in the clutches. Mm. Hmm. That's just super cool, though. Yeah. And these are blackhead cinnamons and super blackhead cinnamon, so it's not just that. Right. It's got to be, so that's why I went back to, well, okay. The pairing that, that made me reproduce him was to a Barnard Line Black Pastel Blackhead female. And that's it? That's it. And, um, and I produced two. So I go, okay, he's got Blackhead, she's got Blackhead. I know there's Blackhead in those with cinnamon, and they're not, so I'm thinking Super Blackhead, Super Black Pastel. That's just, cool. Just by, you know, playing with a couple of clutches. Right. Because if it was some other hidden gene, he sold the background tomorrow and next day. Thank you. So.
ahead and see in their normal spot. Huh? It's next level. I thought they were being here. I, maybe it's got a different spot. I don't know. I have a feeling Dorothy might. Dorothy might what? You see some of these. Hmm. I asked them, they said they're not serving food. Thank you. Uh, I'm so looking forward you know, spending $1,000 on my group and getting a $2 pizza from the street. It's like fucking styrofoam. <laughs> You at least put by Jets. I love Jets pizza. I don't think there's any around here. This is when back in the day, you once in a while you bring Jets pizza into Pontiac. I always, I always get. Uh, if you see. I've known him so long, he's kind of a Oh, okay. the <laughs> 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 No, that's good. I mean, you told me what I said. Hey, the thick guy. Like, almost <laughs> yeah. Like, I didn't want to come over and down. I'm like, yeah, I'm fucking up. I told Strino. I'm like, yeah, that's what I'm doing. Like, yeah, you believe that I was in there. I'm like, yeah. I apologize. Make sure that the last one calls. I felt a little bit more. Yeah, I know. I'm like, I'm going to turn on my ugly face. I'm like, it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like, the video in general of it coming out like that was very good. It turns, that's the problem. By the time you pull out the picture, it turns slightly. And that's what did that. But it was still cool.
It's even there, it's yeah. just gonna still get used to that portion yes. of it. So that, you really take the effort to do this. Yeah, it's just 34 seconds. That's all it takes. It's still crazy. So, I, when I saw them on the table, I, I, I didn't look they look real. Yeah, they do. I, I literally questioned whether these were real. No, I've they, never seen these not out. I'm, I'm possibly the only one person that can. The person I've seen. Yeah, that can actually do this. I never, this yeah. might never do this again, what I'm doing right now. Uh, oh yeah, you can go to other tables and say, hey guys, see this. They're like one of the most beautiful yeah. geckos, and I feel like people don't. They are the undervalued. Now. They're under. They're, I think they're underestimated. Yeah, and well, you just proved. I'm, I'm holding three examples on oh, yeah. top of each other why that's not true. And like I never it's thought. Amazing, so, isn't it? Yeah, I always thought these were just like very beautiful, but like display only. No, kind of. That's, the like, thing. that's not the case. You don't want them bigger. Yeah, you know, the biggest. These guys can live in here. That's awesome. Know, a lot of people will say, oh, they need UVB. It's the D3, you know, that helps them absorb the calcium. So okay. if you have a diet that actually has D3, you don't need UVB. A lot of people say, oh, you need it. No, I need it. No. These guys are nice and plump, nice and healthy. Yeah, they are. And the diet that they need is basically what I use before. You know, they eat pancho as well. They eat crickets, I know. They eat the crickets. So they get that calcium. So without the, without the UVB, they could actually survive. So the only time, as, and when I take them out, I am the freedom guy. Me too. Because even though they're small, but I take them out. So at that, that point, they get the right. you know, freedom to do whatever they want. That's why I let them all. They want to roll They don't go no As you can tell with this little guy. And especially at such a little size. It's, no. it's So if you work with them, you don't move fast. When you move fast, you're, you're a predator. Right. Makes so, sense. So you can tell. I'm just moving slow. You see that? Mm -hmm. I'm not being a threat. I'm not being, you know, aggressive or, you know, being hard on me. So that's why, as you can tell, it's like this. This is you start him like this. 34 seconds a day, you start him like this. You move slow. I can make him go to the next hand. That's it. I can make him go to the next hand. It just knows. Yeah. 
up. He's 
Yeah. Yep. He's having like very long issues. No, no, because of like leaking issues and stuff. So he's like got his snakes and mice and all that. Yeah, they try to fix that. So this, the lighter one is the Enchi, right? The right. Other, the, this is the black Correct. castle yeah, one? Correct, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you probably don't abuse them like that. Oh, <laughs> yeah, right? No, no. <laughs> but maybe it's the white lace thing. I don't know. Even lace combos, they don't, they don't grow as fast as you want them to grow. Yeah, I ended up getting a new incubator. So I, I retired the one that I made myself. Oh, yeah, I wanted to ask. Sea serpents one. Oh, that part. I'm so happy. I want to get into Mandarin. I just wheeled it on in there. It was lightweight. Remember you told me don't buy it if I don't see it? Yeah. I have a very hard time with the Mandarin color. Though. So he's really good. I'm going to do this too. I was just talking about that. A thousand percent. Yeah. I don't, I don't, you don't want to spread them to everything. Oh, because I don't have a lot of space. You know? so, uh, my wife yeah. would straight kick my balls. Exactly. I've done it, so, I've done it several times. <laughs> you so buy something and it's a male and you get to free several females and then you're like, you're just screaming. Yeah, yeah. 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 It just yeah. becomes yeah. more of a volume than that. Right. Right. Get, get it with, it's, it's so important to have yeah. IPO in it, it seems like. Yeah. Yeah. So get a you should be making IPO some this year. Oh, yeah. yeah. We have a couple super clutch yes. videos about that. I, mean, <laughs> I, I will wait. I, will, I, I shall wait. <laughs> but I like the Mandarin project. I want to mix it with the Trojan, too. I think. Yeah. I don't know. I'm nervous about mixing with Trojan. I was hoping that you would do it first, Justin. You know? I who's this? Yeah, I gotta go get out some <laughs> who's this? I was hoping you'd do it first so we can find out who's this. A nice hug. I like this guy. Oh, it's kind of hairy though. It's kind of hairy. I like hairy guys. How you doing, buddy? By the way, Troy Snake is still not breeding for so that's the problem. Not 2,000. Yeah, the Justins, they flip Justin. around instead of Nido and shit. No, Justin's 22 is breeding for me, man. <laughs> Just right down there, my shit spot. Stuck, stuck in ball python row with these guys. I always would be curious. Like, I always end up liking stuff that just, just has not for sale on, and then I have to try to wheel, weasel oh, yeah? it. Oh, yeah? Damn, you're on a different level then. Yeah, so you got to get the good stuff. Not just walking around buying things. Yeah. You spent all your money yesterday, dude. I don't have any money. I just want to look at the pretty snakes that I'll never make. Of course not. Any other monarch stuff? Yeah, we have... Um, we have some more monarch pies that just hatched, but that's really honestly, off the top of my head, that's all we have like, currently okay. going. And, uh, we'll have some more, you know, three, four. Gotcha. Are you doing uh, monarch pie stuff? Working that way? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 
What uh, what stuff in there are you looking at? Any time soon or are you just not wasting it? Yeah. I... I don't think we have anything like patch and perm that is short term. Yeah. You know, we're going for either one. Yeah. I, I, yeah, I think it's, it's looking at you. No, they're both beautiful. I think I like the one with the hurt. Yeah. Yeah. The yeah. Yes. Yeah. I, 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 this I, the pattern's very unique. Yeah. Yeah. I like her a lot. I, 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 I agree. I think it's got, I mean, when the Supers super start coming super out, I think it's going to, the Supers are a clown. It's going to keep taking it to the next level. Yeah. You, 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 I, you, oh my god. There's a little. See that area right there? That yeah. it colors up. That's black. So there's little speckles of black. See the legs? Yeah. When it colors up, that's bright green, and these little speckles are black. I think that is the beginning of one that's turning white. I think it's going to turn black, and then I think it's going to turn white. I think, but I can't. I can't say for sure. So we're going to find out and see what happens. But I think that might be the transition. Is it has to turn one to turn into the top. So that's a weird one. I'd like to produce more. I think he does one. So, so the black one, I thought if you could do the black one, you could definitely do the black one. And the black one, yeah, it's coming up. See how that's weird? It's just, yeah, it's kind of like a digital. No, almost like a digital. That's the rep room. It's lighter in a way. We yeah. do, but you know, somebody was here last night. They came up with a female double head on our puzzle. And what you know if I had it on? Like, no, I'm not even working. Yeah. <laughs> so, I to. But yeah, that's, that's that's what I'm gonna try to go and hit. And I love, you know, as a, the female that I have the puzzle, the original puzzle, she's in size now. I don't wait till till October to give her a little bit more. She she grew fast. She missed one meal, and that was because she had. Made a mess and shed at the same time. I think. Yeah. Oh yeah, stuff. and there's not very many snakes that you can. Um, that can I, I don't know about all garner snakes. I can't claim to know about all of them, but yeah, but you can cohabitate. And, oh yeah, and that's kind of cool. I always like seeing the pictures of all of them. 
like poking their heads out of a hole and whatnot. So if you need to go, I, I need to. yeah. <laughs> no, I know them. No, I know. <laughs> What type of species is this again? You said it's uh, a red sided garter snake or a California garter snake. Okay. But um, yeah, anytime I've helped them cross the road, they usually try to bite me a few times. Maybe they succeed, maybe they don't. And then they chill out when they realize yeah. I have not eaten them or yep. hurt them. And they let me finish my task of letting them into yeah. the grass on the other side of the road. Yeah, she musks. When we first get her out, but once she's out, she's perfectly good. That's uh, I have a king snake that does the same thing. Well, uh, other than the being perfectly fine after a while. Yeah. <laughs> he's uh he's a little cantankerous. Nah. He'll try to eat me. Yeah, I have an Amazon puffing snake at home that I just don't handle anymore. He's nine not foot, fun to handle. Yeah, he's nine foot fun. long. He's a whip too, and he yeah. will whip himself with uh. musk. And then and then if he gets a hold of you, he's he's yeah. biting you and he's holding too. Yeah. So, yeah, I got a nine, my puffer's nine foot long, technically rear fang, so it's like, yeah, yeah I'm not even going to play with you. Yeah, yeah. I'll reach in and touch her, so she's still okay. Texas, Arizona, Nevada, Southern California. They're a relative of the bull snakes that we have around here and throughout the United States, but they are That's red what I thought at mimics. first, was a bull snake. Yeah. There's actually a rattlesnake mimic, so... She's so got that diamond tail? back cutter. Yeah, she'll shake her tail. And they kind of have a little yeah, bit of a... Yeah, a little bit of a diamond back patterning. She has that striping on her tail. When it's moving, it looks like a rattle. She'll also S up with her mouth open, tongues hanging out, and hiss at you. Like a, a traditional diamond back posture. I remember seeing a northern... I think it was a northern pine snake. Okay. It was all black. Yeah. And this thing had like a death hiss. Oh, yeah. That was like intimidating. Yeah. It was like pop tire hiss. Yeah. Yeah, and the pituophis or like the bulls, the pines, the yeah. gophers, they they Powerful. all have an incredible hiss. Yeah, it's, a, it's intimidating. And the only one like really that comes close to it is the kings. Since the kings have the actual glands that help them like vis or verbally hiss. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These guys do it just by breathing, breathing in deeply and exhaling heavily, whereas like actual king cobras have specialized uh, organs that they use to make that big hissing noise. Well, they can have as many organs as they want to make me realize <laughs> to go away. That's fine. Yeah. <laughs> right. I will appreciate them from behind the uh, glass. So yeah, when she's sitting in the sand, her tail is shaking, she's assed up, mouth open, hissing at you. If you didn't know the difference, you'd think this was a diamondback, and you'd turn around and run the other way. Yeah, leave yeah. it alone, that's exactly what they want. <laughs> I'm wrong. <laughs> and that is a Kaboom Viper. Oh, okay. I, I love everything about them. Um, unless I were to become super rich and own a zoo, or something crazy. Yeah. There's just no chance I would have down that. If you need to run and do something, oh, no, you're you are fine. fine. Yeah, I'm just looking. I just got to keep an eye on the only two animals we have besides this is the two lizards over there. So I just got to make sure nobody walks away with them. Yeah, I get you. Because, like, they'll, they've will they been sitting out this entire show. They'll sit out there, no issues. We'll not leave that table unless somebody picks them up or puts their hand underneath them. Yeah. Do they freak out if they try to get picked up? No, not really. No. I know some animals are like chill, but they yeah. don't want to be picked up. Like my cat. <laughs> Very cool. So sh uh, it's a she? Yes. So she'll do the uh, the mimicry to you. Even oh yes. When she was young, she did it a lot. Now that she's used. Oh yeah. Yeah, as soon as as soon as you actually like handle her, this is how she is. Yeah. She's just a puppy dog. That's awesome. And it's cool. If seen from back here, it really looks like a rattlesnake. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Especially imagine a little bit of distance on it to where you're not seeing like the keeled scales and everything. Yes. If you if you get in it's in the night and stuff like that too. Oh yeah. And there's not there's so many people that are ignorant to the fact of what anything is anyway. Yeah. That they're that they're gonna be like, oh my god, that's awesome. I had I've had people at work text me pictures and be like, is that a little rattlesnake? 
He was a gardener. Yeah. <laughs> so one time they were kind of okay close. It was a it was a hog nose. Okay. And I was like, oh man, oh, yeah. you don't see those all the time. You don't see the easterns around here. Yeah, you're like technically rear fang, but yeah, that's about as close as you got. Yeah, venomous snake. Yeah, there. but it's like die if you touch it. Oh, they got the angry look too. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah, they have those scales over their eyes that just make them look mean. That's where they evolved that for us. <laughs> yeah, bulls have them too, but just not as pronounced as the Sonorans. Yeah, they just they just look angry, and the little curled on the lips. <laughs> like the girl at the end, like she's angry, but she's smirking at you. Yeah. If you get a side pick there, you can get it. Let me go move that blue tongue. If okay, you get from the side, you can see mm -hmm. the. I'm trying to get like a good background so you guys don't got to do like a ton of edit or anything. It might be. Tell me if you need to turn her. Uh, you can see rotate her slightly that way. That way? Uh, opposite way. Opposite way. She's gonna look at one direction, but. Yeah. I can only get whichever angle works. Stop, move your thumb, move your thumb. You gonna turn this way for me? Maybe. Ian, I'll come over here to try yeah, to stand, get attention. Stand over here. Come on, bud. Animals do not always cooperate the way we want them to. I think he sees the light. Can you turn off the light? I kind of need it. I'm going to turn it off for now. Ah, oh, shit. No. What? Oh, you returned. So this is a northern blue tongue stick. That was an Egyptian real master. There you go. There you go. Okay. The label. <laughs> no. Come on. The Egyptians are the largest No. They destroyed their background. Yeah. Caimans are super cool. Yeah. These are like awesome. They look like tegus, but then their bodies look like alligators. Like I mean, you saw just that, just that you could easily trick someone into thinking that that's an alligator. Go oh, pee. I'm so sorry. <laughs> that was sexy. This brings up. Go pee. I'm so sorry. Can you edit this out? Uh, not well. If I edit this out, it has to be AI generated in, and that's a lot to generate. Yeah, I'm not. If it was easy, then just to switch, then I would, but it's like take, take. Okay, it. we'll sleep for now. Uh, look at this dude. He's posing. Oh, 
Straight at you isn't as good a little. Yeah, I know it's not. <laughs> Remember the background screwed up over there though. Come on. Oh, I might be trying to fix it. He's underneath of it. All he does is put his back up to fix it. <laughs> there you go. Well, that was a nice one. You can get up a little bit to get stop getting the lip of this thing. I'm not concerned about that. No continuous photo. Continuous photo is video. That is what I'm doing. Okay. Okay. And we miss Oh, cool! Well, I just got the we got the right. so you can wear it here. Right. Yeah. There you go. And competition. So, 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 right. Yep. Yeah. And I heard, like, when I used to read blue tongues, I would put a male to put it in the other one's enclosure and then put the other male in the other one's enclosure. When they feel competition, I need, I need to get ready. So, what are the other one they will always do the locality of the male. Really? Yes. Okay. So it doesn't matter if it's Nicaraguan or Costa Rica, they will always throw the, the colors of the male. So all like the Nicaraguan to a Costa Rican would be mm -hmm. Nicaraguan. Which is really awesome. I didn't realize that. Yeah, because uh, Rainforest Junkie. Yeah, he's, yeah, Mike Novi's got some. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, Did he sell them already? Probably. I bought two females. Oh, okay, so maybe you did buy them already. No, uh, no dog food, no ground turkey, no nothing. It's. Sorry. Sorry. No friends. cat food? No cat food. It's I, all no. snail meat. It's, well, we do like kingfisher diet. Um, we do cro actually Missouri crock chow, they love. Yeah. Um, so. Um, I just had someone try to sell me one of those time cat food. If like, possible, you know, try to get yeah. this yeah. with his tail. Because yeah. your massive tail is. Yeah. It's pretty much defining. Yeah. Feature. I like the angle. I'm just saying. I Question mean. I, the problem, the thing I've come to realize with um, taking pictures of these they're, they're films, pretty sharp, huh? is so the thing I've come to realize with taking out. pictures of, the, of any of these animals like is that unless they're I know, curled I got, up in a ball, Atlanta, it's just, it's, it's like, not practical to try and get everything. It right just, now. it I'm doesn't work. Like uh, it just doesn't work. Dude coming in. What are you doing at the auction? Our auction is we already donated. We donated some cool plants. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, we do we do educational shows, so like we don't breed or we don't you know. So I'm like I don't know what to donate because I don't. I like get we, you. Our services 
no one wants a, a reptile show because everyone keeps reptiles, right? So that would only benefit like maybe a family that was here that like wanted stuff, so. It's just in the background. It's pretty cool. His name is Dr. Pepper. He's 23 flavors. They do. So not not at night when it rains. When the bear. She's just torn this up. I was like, I did just actually realized how much she tore this up. <laughs> Come here. No, I'm not feeding you. I'm not feeding you. You feed them like mice and such? Or? Yeah, I'll give her, I do a lot of seafood with them since they're water monitors. They do need a higher amount of like, good, like fish oil and things like that. Interesting. It's good for, for shedding their skin too. I take fish oil too, but not for that. Same, MCT <laughs> fish oil. Yeah, I just recently started and I just... Feel better? I, I, maybe it's in the brain, I don't know. Sure. I do, yeah. Sorry. I can take her out too. Yeah. yeah. Come here. Oh. I tried clipping her nails when she was in the bath yesterday. Oh, I've seen sometimes some of these shows, I'm sure you've seen it, yeah. where people will come by with like them just chilling on their shoulders and whatnot. I'm always wondering, I'm like, holy cow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all I need is the lanyard. No. <laughs> so expressive. In that. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Hey there. Not gonna be hard to get a photo, but this is definitely a good video. Sure. <laughs> She's awesome. I was gonna just say that the nails hurt, so. I'm okay with it. Yeah, I could. 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 Yeah, I they're such hefty, yes. hefty, strong, powerful creatures. And for a female too, I mean most of them are, like the males are so big. I didn't know, I thought she was a male. And then about a year ago, she laid an infertile clutch of eggs. Oh, <laughs> well, I was like, well that's definitive. That's, uh, that's what happened with our bird. Oh, there you go. We sold them as a male, and then suddenly uh, she got a little uh, more attached to my wife. Sure. And, uh, not that all birds won't do that anyways. But then she um, all of a sudden we come in there and there's like, and there's two eggs. One of sure. them smashed up and one of them just sitting there. I'm like, alrighty, it's not a boy. <laughs> Imagine when that gecko wakes up and is like, what? <laughs> what's it, what's looking at me? Is that better for photos since she's sitting still? There we go. Those photos that he's taking right now, you, they're good. Easily make you think that this is from Jurassic Park. Yeah. That's epic. What's the uh, name of the account or the channel? Rhinos Royals. Rhinos Royals? Yep. Cool. Rh Rhinos Royals. Rhinos Royals. Yep. So on the t shirt? Or? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Where so, are you guys from? Uh, Northwest Indiana, Valpo. Actually. Oh, nice. We're so. right here in like uh, Orland Park area. So. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Kevin so, actually reached out last show. Um, I think said something and then he actually commented on our video said, Hey, don't forget. You can come by. And, uh, who, who did? Kevin. McCurley. No, 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 no. Here. Oh, Kevin Toberman. Yes. 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 Okay, cool. <laughs> That's awesome, man. I'll make sure to give you guys a follow. Yeah, no, I appreciate that. Thank you. We made a, a <laughs> funny joke of it. Like, we realized that like all of our thumbnails. That's what Kevin used, was telling me. Now that you yes. mentioned this. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We're used and we just, just kind of Which is pretty and cool. Like, okay. We call ourselves the Tees Table, so we're all about education, but yeah, um, can't take it home. correct. <laughs> but at the same time, it's like I almost thought too. I'm like, dude, if we could ever I'm justify it, and we took out all of the, the tables. And we, we bought our vision table. 
I would want to bring representations of like, again, a full-grown berm, a full-grown sulcata, a full, so that people know like, hey, I'm coming home with a baby. Oh yeah, bring Fish 120 pounds sulcata, right? God, so many people buy these I know. things, and they they are they're wonderful, and then they're also a terror, right? A terror. Yeah, just grow your actual home. Yep. There's there's like most people do not have the means to keep them. Yeah. Somebody in our neighborhood had them, and it's funny but not funny. Um, when we first moved in, uh, I'm driving home with the family, and I do a double take because there's a 200 pound tortoise cruising down the road, and I'm like, what in the and sure enough, there's just people posting it on the sure, on Facebook. The, yeah, the, the what's oh, happening in Valpo or he whatever. He got right. loose again. He got loose again. I'll oh, come get your tortoise. <laughs> and what was happening is that this tortoise was just walking up to their front door after they leave and be like, boom, and then his front door would fly open. And then he's just like going for a walk.
lives face to face, how much your support has meant to me and Brian. Um, it was really overwhelming last year, the way you guys really come out. And uh, it means more than you know. And uh, I appreciate it. He appreciates it. Um, I love that we've been able to be a part of this community hobby for <laughs> longer than maybe I want to say. <laughs> From the infancy, and yes, but you know what? It's just like anything. You know, um, I'm so happy that that you know it's pretty much the entirety of my and Brian's whole relationship. You know, was circled around with it, and many of you, like, right from the start, and uh, it means a lot to me that you guys, you know, care and support us, um, I can't thank you enough, and um, I'm just very grateful, and I want to be able to, to tell each and every one of you that, just how much I appreciate that, so we appreciate you. Yeah. You know, supporting us, being there, just being, you know, friends, you know, emotionally, you know, prayers, everything. And so I know it's it's not much, but I was trying to think of something I could do to, to give back. So anyone who followed Brian from, you know, the vlog and stuff, you know, he was crazy and funny and was all about shoes. So I was looking at his shoes and, and I picked out a pair and I was going back and forth with the crew and we picked out a pair, and they're, they're slightly worn, they're not, <laughs> not, not bad, like, honestly, the really worn ones, the, the crew's fighting for, <laughs> those are the most, but I just, I picked out a pair that he, he has worn, you know, a handful of times, and whatever we can donate, you know, get for this, you know, is going to the West Heart, because that's, it means the world to me, you know, I, I appreciate so much what they do, and, you know, I will continue to support them with everything I have to do. Know, because that's why we're here, and that's why we do the animals that we have and be able to do what we do. Because we have people like that that are fighting for our rights and doing that. So hopefully, you know, I know it's not going to be much, but I just wanted to, to do something tonight. And thank you guys. a kid into our hobby. And with these shoes, AJ is going to be one of the kids that fills this hobby for us for when we get too old and we can no longer do it next week for some of us. Just kidding, I love you, Potter. Just kidding, just kidding. AJ, will you tell us why you're ready to be in this hobby with us? Um, so... I just love animals. I grew up around them, and they're like my favorite. So I'm just glad to be here. I'm glad to be with Brian, and I'm glad to be with Lori. I'm glad to be with the crew. It's, it's an honor. I like it. It's fun. It's exciting. It's awesome.
250, 200, 200 right there, reach out reptiles. 500 all the way in the back. 700, Renee from Triple L, 700, over 800, over 800, 800, reach out. What we got? 1,000, over 1,100, 1,100 right back there, Triple L, over 1,200, reach out, over 1,300. 2,000, Triple Desert Museum, 2,000, over 2,100. 2,100, reach out, over 2,200. 2,200. 22, 3,000 timber line. 3,100. 3,100. 3,100. Once. We're going to do better. We're going to do better. It's Todd Gilman of timber line. 4,000.